We're Eamon and Beck, and for the past two and a half years, we've called this van home. The beauty of van life is that we've also called these places home for a day or two. Don't get us wrong, sometimes we definitely sleep in dirt car parks or out front a Walmart, but every so often we find paradise. And this is one of those weeks. But just when things were looking a little too good to be true, well. I think it's a starter. The goddamn thing won't start. We are starting the vlog at night. It's not every Aim and Beck video that you get to see us uh, cracking it open at night time. That's true, it's 9 p.m. We're headed to the ferry terminal. We're gonna How come you're looking so gosh darn cute at really? 9 p.m.? Really? Oh, you just made me a nice dinner. This was it nice? No, I didn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Which right. does also doesn't happen very often. That's true, I love your cooking, so sorry about that one. We won't be sharing that recipe. We're headed to the ferry terminal because we're taking an overnight ferry to Menorca. Just sounds exotic. Let's go, baby. Well, we didn't make it very far. We figured gas would be cheaper on mainland and not on the island. Oh, I don't have any shoes on. <laughs> B7, B7. Gold or black? What's more expensive? Gold, right? Ooh, that's a good question. Black it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Should I get black? No, gold. Gold? Wait, what? And that, friends, is why Eamon and Beck don't vlog at night. I can't speak. What? I can't speak. <laughs> Are you doing what I was doing? What? <laughs> I, don't know if, I don't know what that scene was. I went with black. Okay. Gracias. Norca. Norca. Go. So here's the thing. As I was booking, it was 250 euros or so to just come on this ferry. My God. And then it was an additional 200 euros to book a cabin to sleep. So, Eamon and I are gonna just try to stay stealth and sleep in the van. In our own cabin. Because honestly, there's nothing I want more than just, like we'll have such a good night's sleep if we can do that. We were parked in like our own lane and the dude was staring at him in there. <gasps> three? We've now made it half an hour. <laughs> we're sailing, baby. I think we're sailing, but they haven't chained up the van yet. But I think we're good. Nothing makes me happier than being able to sleep in my own bed. We're gonna catch some Z's and talk to you in the morning. Hola, 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 yeah. They made it funny. We both had nightmares that all the cars left because I woke up and checked that. But the cars are still here. Shanti, Shanti. We're on island time, baby. Things go slowly. Just a wee snuggle this morning. Uh-oh. A few changes since we last saw you. Firstly, the parking lot is now full. Secondly, the teas didn't make it into our body. Fast break. Oh, this looks so fine. You know, 
Menorca is gonna be the perfect island when this is just a beach we've happened upon. I found the parking lot and thought, oh, we'll just hang out here for a minute while we get established. And this is just around the corner. So I can't wait to continue exploring. For now, I think we'll just tranquilo it up. What does tranquilo mean? Relax. Calm. Calm. Tranquil. Tranquil. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't think our beach sessions are ever gonna be as tranquilo as they used to be. We now have our backpack full of all of our gear, or most of our gear. And I guess it's only one at a time in the water. I do. It's not super versatile. You prefer something like a little bit more color? The best part about our parking spot today is there's this beautiful little fruit stand just right out front, so we thought we'd stop and grab a Hugo. He's the owner? I'm working for him. Jefe, huh? I'm working for him. <laughs> Hola, Jefe. My name is Halai. Muy bonito. It's wonderful, gracias. <laughs> Adios, te vivi. Adios, have a good one. Thank you, muchas gracias. Gracias, chicos. Hasta luego. Ferry dropped us off near Mahon, and I believe that's the eastern part of the island, and Eamon and I are really interested in about 30 minutes away, along the southern coast of the island, more west. So we're gonna hop in the car. What are you doing? Checking out your boobs? My nipples are stinging. They're stinging? Por qué? I don't know. The salt Something water? Something in the water. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna head to the next beach spot. Click it or take it. We've arrived to our second destination and realized it's Friday, which is typically a work day for us. So we've decided to actually end today's vlog here so we can catch up on some much needed work. We'll catch you guys in the morning. Eamon's already hard at work over there. You got such a slouched position there, Bubba. Say goodnight. Hola, buenas. Buenos dias, everybody. I hope you're doing well. We have a beautiful sunny day here. It's muy calor. Mucho calor, and our only problem is our lack of food stash. So we're just trying to figure out a little brekkie at the moment. Yeah, we need food. Okay, we could just put some avocado on these crispy things. I actually really did end up liking it, and you? Yeah. Hmm. Shall I make the pasta as well? Mm-hmm. And maybe you could get me some shade? As you guys know, we've been looking for an awning for quite some time. And there aren't really all that many options out there. I actually ordered this on Amazon. And it wasn't cheap. But I didn't really think it through. And the poles kept falling down. Which is why I am very excited to introduce to you Moonshade. Uh, buddy, it's upside down. <laughs> Moonshed. <laughs> Voila! This is the moonshade. Seriously, so simple to set up. We actually have it set up to our solar panel, which has a little pin, and then to our roof rack, so it's literally just kind of snaps on. If you don't have a roof rack, it comes with these little suction cups. You can stick it onto basically any surface. We love this product. It's the perfect solution for us. We didn't want to get a fixed awning. Um, something that stands out as more of like a recreational vehicle as well as those things are really really heavy 
So this thing is super light, super versatile. As you see, it packs down to the size of a tent. And we got shade inside now with the door open. That is such a game changer for us. Mamma mia, how's the lunch going? Uh, they say if you can't stand the heat, stay out of the kitchen, right? <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate the shade, baby. If you guys are interested in checking out Moonshade, our friends over there are just launching this product on Kickstarter. So there's a link in the description box right at the top and you guys can check it out and pick one up for yourself, Van Lifer. One last quick point on the Moonshade. I think they've done an amazing job of selecting really good materials. So like even these little carabiners are like made of metal. It's not like cheap plastic. And I think the thing will hold up for quite a long time. Time to tear down and head to La Playa. Tear it down. Should we do a timer tear? Timer tear down? Timer tear down. And go. <laughs> Time. Two minutes and four seconds. <laughs> I think we could have done it quicker next time. Next time. You're wearing shoes? See, I am. I don't know why that took so long, but. Island time, baby. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to tell you what time it is. Right, let's go to the beach. Let's go to the beach. Usted está aquí. We're here. We're going to check out Mitana. Cala Mitana, and then there's supposed to be like a little Mitana, Mitanita. Mitanito. Over, yeah, over this way. And then maybe, depending on how we're feeling. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> a little conversation about smiling and how it's like literally impossible to smile. Wait. No, what you're trying to say is I once read this and I think it's very true. Yeah. That even if you're not feeling good and you force a smile, which is yeah, yeah. so silly, you're like, mm, I'm grumpy. And then you force your smile like this. You can't smile while it. being upset. Yeah. It just all of a sudden, look, my mood was just elevated by 10. Yeah. By 10. Yeah. And we're finding. Tips for you guys. A lot of, what's going on with this exposure? There's a lot of people out here that don't like smiling. I was saying that I love smiling. Beck, Beck usually forces it on them. <laughs> yeah, if, Hola. if you've noticed someone who's in need of a smile, you could just give them one of yours. See ya. come to the beach to relax. <laughs> we relax for 10 minutes and then Eamon gets bored. Challenges me to push-ups. Gotta get the push-ups in. Well, I think we're a little late to the party here. Everyone's packing up. The clouds are here, the wind is here. <laughs> Dios mio. I'm gonna start waking up early. I'm gonna start drinking coffee. That's what I just <laughs> said. We really like to listen to our bodies and get the sleep we need, which is awesome. But also, we need to start getting up really. It's just the way it needs to be. Yeah. And the question of the day, did we get robbed? Oh, bud. That's just how messy we left it. <laughs> Would you have liked the pasta at the beach we that I made? the pasta to the beach. <laughs> Life lesson? What was I thinking? Never listen to myself. Yeah. <laughs> Beck made a really tasty lentil bolognese spaghetti kind of style pasta. So we're gonna scramble diddly dum that down because <laughs> we haven't really eaten anything. And then um, figure out a plan for tonight. 
I have a little bit of a plan for tonight. It's just whether you'll go with me. You just hop in the passenger seat. What? I'm gonna take you on a little date night. You're driving? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he says disappointedly. Are the airbags working? I'm just kidding. No. I'm just kidding, jeez. Wow, I had this really nice idea and now I think I'll drop you off and I'll take myself on a date night. See ya. See ya. Buddy, I figured I'd drive because we were gonna drown. Yeah. Give me, give me that sunshine, sunshine. Give me, give me them good times, good times. Nothing, nothing but good vibes, good vibes. Give me, give me that sunshine, sunshine. Every day is a new beginning. Every day is a gift to hold up high. All right, baby, we've arrived for day night. I think we could go in like this, but should we get changed? <sighs> oh, a little wrinkly, but we clean up good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go, baby. I was thinking we could have a quick appetizer. Are you kidding? Well, I'm doing this one. A clove of garlic. Beck and I both are not feeling well, and bottoms up, baby. Bottoms up. Oi. Oi. If we didn't smell before, now we smell and have garlic breath. <laughs> Vamos. Okay, so this place you need a ticket to get inside, but you do get a free drink. But did he give you the tickets? I think once you're in, they... Uh, come on, son. Wow, it's beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> it's like in the cliff. Isn't this so beautiful? She hasn't even had a drink yet. a little nervous, but don't worry guys, I got you. <laughs> Do you want some nice lighting on me? Oh, very bright, very unrealistic, but okay, wow. Um, <sighs> go back to the car, try yeah. to start the van. And didn't turn over at all, not even like a little puff. Oh, that sounds better. Yeah? Yeah. What is that? I think it's a starter. Aim and I were just talking about recovering from everything and how our throats are a bit sore because of all the drama and how it feels so good to be on the other side and like healing. Now the god dang, the god dang van won't start. What do we even do about that? I'm gonna go have a look. Okay. Battery? No, I think it's a starter for some reason. Contacting. Smart car sales. <laughs> You've been watching for a while, you'll know Russ. He's a bit of a character, aren't you, Russ? Aren't ya? <laughs> Amigo, won't you answer? Won't you answer my gosh darn call? Oh, Amigo, <laughs> you decided not to answer. <laughs> Check starter battery fuses. Happy Thanksgiving to back. <laughs> I'll hold the light for you? Yeah. Okay, okay so, uh, it's possible, um, I 10 minutes, we can let it charge. Uh, you need to wear it. It's like five minutes. What do you think? 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 What do you think?
I know. I know, it's a bit random, so I do apologise. Now, I'm thinking because we're on a hill, we could just kind of roll back into that flat area over there. If it won't work, then something no good. Thanks, Russell. Thanks, Russell. <laughs> if it won't work, then something no good. Taking us somewhere else. Oh my, gosh. oh my gosh, are you safe? Yeah, I think so. Let me just turn a little sharper. Push, buddy, come on! <laughs> Russ says leave it till the morning and then... Try again? Try again. Really? But we're screwed now, like... <laughs>